all of these like, people, all these fucking guys, they're all fan Losers. girls. They, they, they all recognize greatness. They recognize the greatness in me. Mm-hmm. Let's start, let's start there. And I'm not trying to be, so when I make videos, I'll let someone know, like I, I would say this to anyone's face and they know that. Yeah. I see you. Uh, I see you tag Hassan Piker every time you make a video. About him, you know, like, I tag all those guys. Yeah. I mean, I'm absolutely unafraid to hold on Amy. There we go. Thank you. You'll provide the visuals. Um, what do you got? Green screen? Yeah. Look at that. I'm but fancy. It's, but it's not opaque. You need lighting because I can see the kitchen in the background. I know, I know. <laughs> How's it going? You look like a Spider-Man vibe. I'm not feeling too good today, so I'm a little bit high on NyQuil. I was going to go to bed pretty early. Yeah, the drugs I had to come in here because I just I went Ooh. in there and it was retarded. So. Yeah, it's, it's stupid. But you got the blue and the red. I think that's what's giving me that Spider-Man vibe. And it's like... Oh. Yeah. Where are you seeing red? Oh, the, the yeah, I see. So, um, yeah, let me just frame this. So basically, it's it's been very strange to witness that these dudes spurg out on things that are so basic, and it's like this shocking thing where you have to stop and go, "Oh, wait a minute, you need that to be explained to you." What did we just witness tonight? You had a stream. These fucking weak men have done a stream about tweets of mine. I mean, the second, the second you start screen capping the tweets of another man and then like going back to your little hovel of fucking beta dudes and being like, hey guys, the, the, the dude, that guy, he said something about me. Here's a screen cap of it. Let's talk about it. Yeah. Like, that's when you know you're just, you're deficient. There's, you have nothing to bring to the table. These guys are total fucking losers. They don't even know how to talk to women. None of these guys are getting their dick sucked. You guys no. are fucking idiots sitting on the internet crying about a tweet, trying to make drama over some guy. Yeah. Like, it looks like no other way, but they're just trying to use AIU in their title to get people to come watch. Right. It's Kumite so, shit. Fourth tier Kumite, like Dan it's, said. It's a bunch of nobodies. It's a bunch of dudes who are like, th- that's the bottom line, and it's awkward when you deal with autistic people. Like, you could have an autistic person come on, and you could talk about whatever you want. But mm-hmm. underneath it, there will be a current, a knowledge that everybody with an earshot can pick up on, which is, this is incredibly awkward. This man is mentally retarded. Yeah. Like, so trying to decipher whatever the fuck he's talking about, be my guest, go go wild with that. But the guy's brain is not good. It's broken. It's- Devin, they so- can't even handle being asked a simple question. Like, why? what is this about? What are you guys doing this for? And then yeah. like- they start ascribing intent to you and thinking they know what you're saying when you directly said <laughs> something to them. And I'm like, Esau, stop reading between the fucking lines. I said exactly what I mean. He's like, no, I am going to read between the lines. Okay, so you're admitting that you're going to make shit up and you're going to fucking lie. And this is why you're a beta bitch. This is yeah. why nobody likes you. This is why you have no fucking friends. And this is why you have to bounce around like the fat fuck you are and just take whoever fucking likes you. You have no integrity. You hang out with fucking losers. Absolutely. I mean, look at the people but, you associate with. Get the Amy, fuck out of here. He is a loser. Yeah. That, that's why yeah. that's his crowd. His, his life is a life of quiet misery. Uh, yeah. it, it ceases to be quiet when he lashes out. And you could sort of tell like, oh, oh, there's a well of sadness there. Yeah. Like that guy's got nothing going on. And he is yeah. a liability to himself. He's a health hazard to himself. Yeah. And was, so, so basically what I was saying about the autism, the equivalent with these guys, some of them are straight up aut- autistic, but outside of that, they are not talented or entertaining. No, so, not at all. So they are, they are like 10th tier followers who, have fo- who are copying a format, doing it horribly well. I mean, just yeah. so bad, so boring, totally unwatchable. Mm-hmm. And, they're, and they're just being weak bitches. So, hiding, hiding behind fake yeah. names, mm-hmm. and then cowering, and then somebody calls them out on this, and like, hey, if you want to, you know, talk shit, say it to my face, and then they're like, yeah, and then I told him, I gave him a real zinger with a meme. Of course, I didn't. Devin, your feelings name. are hurt. Your fifis are so hurt. Exactly. <laughs> oh, I heard these guys. They go, you know, Devin. One thing about Devin, uh, he doesn't like it when uh, people uh, throw punches at him, or he doesn't like it when he's called a racist. Yeah. Like that's a difficult one to figure out. Right, right. And they're like, it's the internet, man. It's just what happens. Oh, really? Well, then, okay, we'll come at you then. We'll come at you and it's it's just the internet, man. How about that for a meme? It's just the internet. Fuck that. Yeah, that doesn't make it any better. It's just life. This Life is going to happen to you. 
and they said that they said that to me and i was like so you're basically saying the internet's full of bitches then right no, <laughs> like it doesn't make it any better you know what it is to say it's just the internet i'll tell you what that is that's the uh, guppy defense that's what a guppy would say they'd be like oh yeah it's just the school it's a swarm of fish man there's so many fish in the sea look if a fish is going to come by and bite you in the ass or try to eat you it's like dude that's the ocean man that's the ocean and then they're going to hide back in the swarm of fish because they don't yeah. want to be singled out that's their worst fear is that they actually get confronted that's why they need to be five of them at a time yeah oh my god and like they'll never be like oh my god you know what let me let me come on and uh and talk to you like let me oh, Zevin, let me you know how Esau was behaving when it was you me Jamie and him was he oh, a cunt like he was would he have the fucking the the courage to say some of the shit that he did today or behave the way he did if no he fucking wouldn't because he's a weak roly poly cunt ass bitch all of these like, people all these fucking guys they're all fan losers. girls they, they they all recognize greatness they recognize the greatness in me mm -hmm. let's start let's start there and i'm not trying to be no 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 here's humble. the other thing that's funny no 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 you're like once in a while it'd be nice to actually hear you take credit for being awesome but like these guys are like, you're a fucking Devin Dick writer. You're here to defend him. I'm like, I'm not here to defend Devin, but I don't take, that's like saying you're a Sam Harris Dick writer. I'm not insulted by that. Yeah, it's no. Just so but anybody knows. It's, it's the, it's the, um, the cult of like contrarianism. So they think don't like anything. Don't be yeah. about anything positive, tear down, mm -hmm. rip down, bring everyone down to your bullshit, like level of autistic nothingness. Mm -hmm. So they don't achieve anything. Like, imagine if one of those guys on that cast was just like super funny, super charming, interesting, filled with ideas, coming up with mm -hmm. all sorts of shit, like real, like a obvious talent that like millions of people would recognize. Yeah. It would be different. People would be like, wait a minute, be. there's something here. Like, do you think they have a Justin Timberlake in that group? That is, if, if that group is in sync, do you think there's a Justin Timberlake in there? Oh, yeah, Devin, you know that Esau is just hella jilted because he got rejected by like the by coolest everybody. online community. Like, yeah. yeah, they all are. But what, what do these people do? What are their jobs? What are their names? Like, what the fuck? Yeah, what are you it's, doing? It's incredible. And then they have the nerve. They bring up ancient non-drama from Yeah, autistic. what is this 14-year-old doxing right. shit again? Right. No, no, I'll talk about it. Let's let's rehash this 14-year-old doxing drama. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. They're like, oh, he doxed a 14-year-old. That's the headline. That's what the beta males will huddle around and be like, oh, well, that's morally fag on him. So so they'll <laughs> so they'll be like, look, hey, uh, Jews, kill the Jews, the kikes, yeah, fuck him. Uh, who's this bitch who uh, Justice Kavanaugh was, you know, trying to date rape. Fuck, fuck that bitch. Fuck women and all this. And they're edgy as can be. But then, oh, something happened to a 14-year-old potentially. His name might have been released. Ooh, that's my fear. His name that's is my... like on the internet. Okay. So it's so fucking hypocritical that they're like, hey, man, that's the internet, man. Shit goes down the internet. People are going to call you racist. Well, people are going to dox you then. Is that also yeah. part of it? So yeah. this whole thing is pre uh, prefaced on the fact that they know that when I, at that time, when I was saying the word dox, it was not the common understanding of the word dox. No. It was the, Word docs as defined by Vadim Newquist. Yeah. Who's docked who, up. Right. So Vadim Newquist, a guy making videos about me, calling me a racist online, a guy I don't know, a stranger on the internet with like 40,000 subs is saying, this guy's a racist by name. Mm -hmm. Somebody tells me his name. I'm talking to him on Twitter. A this guy, Anthony, tells me his name. He goes, oh, by the way, that guy's name is Vadim Newquist. I spend a point, two seconds thinking about it and go, hey, Vadim Newquist, why are you calling me a racist online? Right. That is oh, many cowers. as morally normal a thing you could possibly do. Yeah. As morally normal a thing as you could possibly do. Um, if people want to come on the internet and talk shit let, and not be responsible for any of the things they say and don't want to give a fuck about the consequences of doing that because so, they're hiding behind a, a pseudonym. You know, the way I see that thing with the 14 year old kid is you, you're basically teaching him a valuable lesson uh, okay. to being yes. a man. And it's the same lesson you just taught Cog that he's not catching. Right. So. Let, let, we'll get to that. First, let's go stay on Vadim. This is why the word dox is even yeah. used. Vadim makes a video saying, I got doxed. So I had never heard that word before. And I thought, so wait, to dox someone is to reveal their publicly accessible name? Mm -hmm. I'm like, well, that's just fucking LARPing nonsense. What are you, what are you people doing? You scared little bitches. 
Yeah. I'm Devin Tracy. Who the fuck are you? If you want to have your little independent life and not talk shit, be my guest. If you're going to slander me and have give me a reputational hit to the point where my name is associated with your slander, mm -hmm. I don't think people understand that. Yeah, no. When don't. I was trying to get an apartment in in uh, Melbourne, mm -hmm. they were like, "What I do you do this, yeah. And I go, "Oh, I'm a YouTuber." They go, "Oh, really?" And I go, "Oh, fuck! I shouldn't have said that." They go, "Really? What channel?" So now I. Now I'm hoping this guy has my political views. I'm hoping he's you know, woke about race, but I tell him my channel, I don't get the apartment. And he goes, mm. dude, it's, it was because of that. It was straight up because of that.